as you are written in your notebook now the last example which i have given in the notes um, our class car has the properties like height weight color speed so these properties whatever we are having they are called as state of the object or data members remember this they will ask you this question in the interview okay what is a property what is an instance variable what is the state of an object why we call it as a state of an object because it represent at any given point of time what is the state of an object for example what is its color what is its height what is its weight so the properties can be called as state of an object data members instance variable or properties is it clear now the remaining the methods what we are having okay so we call them as behaviors behaviors can also be called as member methods these behaviors whatever we are having here can also be called as member methods now we can also use a term like action because a behavior is more like an action or is a combination of action but when you say members of class we are talking about both properties as well as behaviors they together we can call them as members of a class is it clear suppose if you have any member that is basically a static member then we don't call it as a member of a class okay or we call it as we don't call it as data member instead of that we call it as a static member or class variable so i'm going to teach you about uh, static the difference between static and non static in the upcoming lessons that is access specifiers and modifiers now that we know that uh, we can create an what uh, we represent we know how to represent the real world object in java now is the time we create an instance of a class or instantiate a class so this we can do using new keyword suppose you can say new car in this case what happens the memory for all the members of car gets allocated so they'll ask you the question what is an object so your answer should be an object is an instance of a class so when we say instance what you are pointing here instance means the memory is allocated for all the members of a class so if i say new car i can say that memory is allocated for all the members of the car 